Hey, 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 hi everybody. I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you're all smiling and enjoying your lovely day. In this following tutorial, I'll be showing you on how to set up walking and running inside of Wadudo. So that way you can do some really fun um, actions for your stream, you know? Very fun stuff, especially when you're walking through your environment or uh, doing some walking stream with Wadudo's environment and such, you know? You could do those kinds of cool stuff, really, just for fun. Um, or train your character like a game character, really. But what you're going to do is that you'll have to join the Wadudo Discord server as someone named Turu actually distributed the blueprint. So you have to be in the Discord server. Uh, unless Turu provides a non-Discord link, because I understand some people hate Discord. Uh, but the um, I do recommend joining the Discord server so that way you can access especially newer versions of the, um, of the blueprint. So keep that in mind. Now... You know, you can be able to find it. So when you uh, join the Wadudo Discord server, you'll scroll all the way down until you find the blueprint sharing form here. You click on that and it should look something like this where there's a little mannequin, the Mixemo mannequin and the uh, Tudu's character. It should look something like this. You can look it up if needed for future reference, but it should look like this. You click on it and from here, there's going to be a long chat message here and such. Um, I heavily recommend again, just, you know, going to from the bottom and slowly scrolling until you find something that looks like this, where Tudu made a message about a uh, blueprint. So simply you just click on the download button right here. And it'll and they'll let you know if you need to download something. So for this version here, it needs the data change detector nodes. So you'll have to make sure to subscribe to those. I'll show you how to subscribe to it. Uh, but also as well um, in the instruction, which you can scroll all the way up. So that way you can see like what it features and some advice that they have. For example, you can't use this for sale. Um, you also need to make sure like again to disable handheld movement and you know just follow these instructions that they have here pretty much and also you have to download the Mixamo walking running anims which I've converted so it can be used for this so definitely make sure to also subscribe to the animation that I have again I'll show you how um but it is there you know the instructions are there so it's convenient so there you go now uh, what you're going to do in Wadudo, you're going to go over to the Discover tab right here. And then from here, um, you'll click on Plugins and we're going to type in Data. And from there, you're going to find the Data Change Detector node. So make sure you click on that and subscribe to it, which is free. So just download it with this button. Make sure you subscribe to it. And then you're going to find Mixamo. Find it under Miscellaneous. And you'll see right here, Mixamo walking, running, anims here for movement controller. Uh, for my case, uh, yeah, so the subscribe button's over here for me. Yours will probably in the middle. So find this and you'll be able to download it. Then um, after you downloaded the anims here and the data change detector, uh, what you'll then do as well um, is you're going to go over to blueprints right here. And then you'll go over here, press on more, and you're going to import a uh, blueprint from file. So once you've downloaded, which I did, I'm going to go ahead and click right here and add that there. There you go. And you should be able to see when you scroll out, uh, there is this big node. Now, in case, let's say you may want to change the animations to something else, you can. For my case, uh, because I did not install the uh, the Wadudo or the Mixamo anims that I did because I was the one that converted them, so I can't really download it. So for my case, I have to actually manually register mine, which you can do it right here where it says change animation. You can even change speed over here to a different value. So you can play with it again. If you know decimals, uh, the lower the number, um, you know, the lower the decimal, the slower, the bigger the decimal, the more fast you are. The default saying they're fine, but it's really just up to you. And um, but over here, just kind of like, you know, right here, the first one here is going to be walking. So I'm going to find walk and I'm going to use um, I'm going to use a female walk here but you can also use uh, the walk over here I believe there's also a new walk yeah there's also the new ones that Wadudo provides you can use as well if you want um, like this one and such so you can do that 
Then jogging, I'm going to go ahead, uh, find the jog one here. There you go. And then I'm going to go over here and I'm going to put in running, so running here. And there you go. I registered my animations. You can also change speed there if you like. Um, if you want to mess with the blueprint more, you can. There are also little notes here that tells you on, like, this tells you, like, okay, this is, like, the setting for it. It says zero, uh, you can turn instantly or have some smoothness. So if you want to increase and such, you can. Um, but keep an eye on the notes. They will help you a lot. This one also here says that you can replace uh, the two nodes with find asset by name if you want to be specific. Um, again, the instructions are there, but by default, you should be pretty much good. And all you have to do is just press on your arrow keys on the keyboard and you'll start moving around. Uh, you'll notice that the camera did teleport, so you just have to scroll out. Um, what it did is that it made it where the camera is free look, so you'll do WASD um, instead of the orbit, which you can switch back by pressing the V button to switch back to orbit camera, but you can press V again to just make it back to um, free look. And from there, you can see how I am able to rotate around like such. And if we were to add an environment as well, you can also see that I will be moving around. So let me go to asset here, um, add an asset, go over to environment, add environment. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna add, hmm. Let's say we're gonna do the loft apartment. We'll have that loaded. I'm gonna look ridiculous, don't mind me. But you can see how when I'm doing the WASD, I'm able to pretty much walk around still got my tracking going on and just able to just walk around and be like hey chat how you doing i hope you have a lovely day <laughs> um so you could do that and um if you hold the z button while you do uh the moving you can be able to run around so you can run like this um and if you want to jog so lightly run just hold the x button so x will do this like light jogging and Z for if you want to freaking run, run as fast as you can. The VTuber is coming. So yeah, um, so you can do that. Yay. But either way, um, that's pretty much how you could do the walk blueprint inside of Waterdo. Uh, pretty cool, right? And hopefully you can be able to uh, have fun with your audience and show them how amazing your setup is. And thank you, Tudu, for providing this blueprint because Tudu's the one uh, who allowed everyone to be able to walk, run around, and do some crazy shenanigans. But um, I hope that this tutorial helps you. Again, please join the Discord server, uh, the Wadudo Discord server. And that's all I have to say. Have a lovely day, everyone. And see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Thank you to all my Snowflake members. In case you don't know, I have YouTube membership. So if you want to further support this channel and what I do, then feel free to join the Snowflake members. Otherwise though, just your support means so much to me and I appreciate every ounce of it. Either way though, with that being said though, hey, 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 goodbye bye everyone. I hope to see you guys next time, okay? Bye bye.